I'm just doing. I'm literally just doing this natural language in the with your voice. With your with voice. My voice. voice. I, not a single, not a single keyboard entry. Yeah. Other than return to, you know, accept the voice command, and no mouse action. I'm yeah. basically just narrating what I wanted to do, and it would say, okay, like I'm having problems georeferencing this. How do you, how do you want to proceed? And I said, well, give yeah. me, give me, give me your options of what you're thinking. And it'll say, okay, like we can we can download the USGS layer. We can um, we can use the you know the DC um, overhead you know layer in JPEG. You know we can mm -hmm. do this. And then I would say, okay, let's let's try this. And and if that didn't work, I'd say, okay, let's let's work on the um, let's work on the visualization for a while. And we worked on it. And when we went back to the the map layer, and I'll, I'll show you. I mean, it is it's fantastic. And it would. It, it took me an hour and yeah. I never left MCP. I never touched the computer keyboard mm. and yeah. it would have taken me days to do this in Power BI. Try if it. I even could have. Yeah. I mean, Try I don't it. think I could have done this except with maybe um, James Dale's Icon Map Pro. Mm -hmm. But that's just one thing that you've done. Like, you know, you could do. Right. I've got to tell you, like, how different my life is now, like, around my computer. But, like, when you talk through, like, how you do that, it is just so much more scalable as well. Like, this is what I'm seeing is that not only you did that in an hour, right? But imagine doing 20 of those things in an hour, like, just spinning them all up, you know, and getting them run. Like, this is what is happening. This is what is going to be possible like very 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 soon right the ais can just work like work a thousand times faster than a human could right and like a lot of these things that they're, they're all just things that models can just can constantly spit out right and you just like layer one thing on top of the other and then you put them into loops and then they just can just continuously go and go and go it's it's honestly mind-blowing